Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 6th. So let's just keep in mind that the timing is fluid, okay? So what do we have for around the 6th? King of Cups reversed. So the overall energy is a feeling of withdrawn, being withdrawn, uh, non-communicative, uh, secretive, closed off emotionally. We, you know, the King of Cups in reverse is somebody that uh, may not be able to master their emotions very well, um, or they just don't communicate. The King of Cups in reverse could be somebody that sees themselves as a victim. Five of Wands reverse. So who? This is a person. Could be a water sign. Doesn't have to be. Could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, but it could be anybody. This is somebody that is is closing off themselves emotionally. Um, there's some sort of conflict here or power struggle with the Five of Swords reversed. Or Five of Wands reversed. My mistake. This, there's, there's, this, is, this is exhausted, fed up. Ooh, Queen of Coins reversed and the Seven of Coins reversed. So this is... Uh, somebody's not putting in much effort. They're, they're not uh, doing their part. This could be a dead end. The Queen of Coins in reverse is somebody that is jealous, spendy, or doesn't have anything to offer, doesn't make poor financial decisions. The Queen of Coins in reverse is an individual that is very possessive. There's probably a fight. There could be like a war. You know, a fight, a battle of some sort. Mm. Oh, wow. Most definitely. Five of Swords reversed. That is a battle. A full-scale battle. There's going to be a fight of some sort. Uh, somebody might end up walking away. Mm. I don't know if this fell out reversed or not. I mean, it did. I mean, in my hand it's reversed, but it flipped. And it did flip to reverse, so we're going to keep it that way. There is some sort of aggression here. We definitely have a battle that's going to happen, okay? This is a fight of some sort. King of Swords, reverse, abusive, hard, cold, uncaring. We have somebody here that has no remorse. They have no remorse. They have no moral conscience. They want to win at all costs. And they're. Gonna, I think there's going to be some mean, mean, nasty words that are going to be said. Wow. The Magician, reverse. We definitely have... Uh, some, this is a very tricky situation. There's a lack of, of... And my deck is not reversed. I've been flipping the whole time. Uh, and I don't, anybody that says it might as well just leave. And maybe that's part of it. And everything that comes out of my mouth is part of this reading. Maybe you should just leave. You know, that's what this energy is. If, you know, if you're going to lie, if you're going to try to control me, then you might as well leave. That's the kind of energy I hear. I hear somebody, there's been an abuse of power. I feel like there is uh, somebody, uh, we have a master manipulator here that is, uh, I don't know if we're dealing with a narcissist or what. Somebody's probably thinking about leaving anyway. But they're feeling powerless. It's like their power has been stolen. So we have a Queen of Pentacles here whose, whose power has been stolen by an individual that is abusive. We have abuse of power here. 
it feels like we have a masculine, masculine, masculine energy. And it doesn't have to be a masculine. Women do this as well, but this is a masculine energy that is, is stealing somebody's power. This is like a narcissist. And there's going to be a massive fight by the looks of things. Ace of Cups reversed. This is sad. This is a loss of emotional content. There's an emotional blockage. There's tears being shed. There's going to be a fight that causes some tears. I do feel like uh, it's going to be a big one. This is a big fight. We have an individual here that is taking action without thinking. And they're very, very arrogant. Very arrogant individual here. Ah, of course. We get one upright and his nine of swords. This is uh, despair, anguish, sadness, uh, fear. Fear. Somebody's very fearful. They're afraid. They're afraid of... Uh, or thinking a lot at night too. Thinking about this sad situation they're in. Very, very depressed. We have a depressed individual here that just doesn't know what to do. And I think that they could, they're probably crying. They probably will cry at night when they're in bed. Think about leaving. They want to leave. Whoever they're dealing with is probably very, very abusive. Very arrogant. Uh, doesn't listen. Uh, is closed off. Is secretive. This Whoever they're dealing with. Uh, no, the, it's like you, you know that this person is keeping secrets, you know. It's definitely some tears being shed at night. There's instability. There's insecurity. This is, uh, it's a sad situation by the looks of things. Oh, uh, what do we got here? Nine going my own way. Nine of and nine of pentacles. This is going my own way. This is enjoying the finer things. I, I this is being alone. This is uh, somebody that is has the skills to take care of themselves, to be independent. Somebody that is choosing to be independent that doesn't need anybody else. So I do feel that we have an individual that is making a choice to go their own way because it's better off to be single and be happy than to be in a partnership where there's secrets and lies and deception and uh, abuse. And this is what we got. So we have somebody here that it's like they get into bed at night and it's like they, it's like, you know, I can't do this anymore. I'd rather be alone. And I think what happens is during the fight and there's going to be a big one. Okay. It's going to be a big fight. I think there's going to be a fight where, you know, it's, it's a, it's like a, it's like it's over. This is it. You know, just leave. Somebody says, just leave. Why don't you leave? I think we have somebody here that is mentally dysfunctional or they're mentally unbalanced. They have some mental health issues. It's like a psychopath, narcissist energy that has been depleting another person of, you know, stealing their power, stealing their, their mojo, making them feel insecure. I mean, that's what a narcissist does. And it's like whoever this person is that goes to bed at night in tears is like, this isn't realistic. This is unreal. Why am I investing in this uh, relationship that is one-sided? So I do feel like we have somebody here that is going to find their strength and their courage to go their own way. They're better off alone. It's like, I'm better off alone with that Nine of Pentacles. Single. Nines are a sign to move on. It's time for closure. 
somebody has been tolerating tolerating a lot of abuse and it's like I, it's like you can't tolerate it anymore there's no more growth here this is a dead end I don't I don't want to live like this one more card one more card so there's I feel like there's going to be a separation I do ah the lovers the lovers is, is a ex unexpected choice in love this is a major choice Somebody is looking, and it comes from self-love. This is somebody that is very capable of success on their own. But they may be in a loveless situation right now where they are being manipulated. Once they pick themselves back up, they have a new lover. Anyway, this is an unexpected choice in love. But this is a very sad decision. It is. It's a sad choice. I think that we have a separation here. I do. We have somebody that is very, very depressed. But I, I am going to change this a little bit. We also have an independent person that is not even invested in finding love this person is enjoying life is very solid and stable and secure now there's an unexpected opportunity for love so however this resonates with you this is a single person that has an opportunity for love not even looking for it by any means whatsoever and then in this person that is single and choosing to be single is probably single because they were abused. And you know, it's funny how we all play out in these parts. We all at different cycles in our lives. We have some people that are watching this that are in this abusive cycle right now. We have some that are in this independent cycle that are coming together with a new lover. We have one person up here that it doesn't know their value because their value has been stolen by a master manipulator who is abusive. Anyhow, we have an unexpected choice in love. This is about being single or being in a commitment. There's definitely going to be some tears shed. This independent person has closed themselves off emotionally. And not invested in any type of love. Better off to be alone than to get hurt. But now there's an unexpected choice in love that is coming in. This is a soulmate connection. I do also feel like we have an individual here that is leaving walking away from their abuser at this time exploring other options however way you look at it there's other options here I don't think we need any more cards. It's a day of decision. I think that there's an element of sadness here. Somebody is going to be choosing stability and security. 
and in, to enjoy life with their head up rather than their head down. And it's because they get in a fight. They get in a massive fight. It is a massive fight. Trust me, it is. And it's like, I want a soulmate. I'd rather be alone than with the wrong one. That's what I, that's kind of like, that is what I'm hearing. We have a very cold hearted, cold hearted individual here who has abused their power. This abuser is about to lose. Good luck.